All right then, hello guys. So I'm gonna do another Pico CTF challenge, and the challenge we're gonna be doing today is gonna to be called SSTI2. So what is SSTI2? It's basically I made a cool website where you can announce whatever whatever you want. I read about input annotation, so I can remove any characters that could be a problem. I hear templating is cool and modular way to build web apps. Check out my website here. So it's similar to the first one that we did, but I'm guessing they have some kind of sanitization so if you look and try our first one that we use right here we're gonna see if it works or not I'm pretty sure that it won't because it says they sanitize that so let's see control V stop trying to break me so we get that so now let's try the other one that they have and this was basically just by searching up uh, 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 Pi jail SSTI and it should be the very first article, server side template injection with Jingo by on security. So let's try this next one. If WAF blocks, try this. So we're gonna try this, I'm assuming. Let's see right now. I think uh, we'll go back to this one right here and see if it blocks it. Stop trying to break me, we still get that. So now if we go back right here, it says if WAF blocks and so WAF blocks dot and dash. Oh, so we probably could have used this, but either way, it got caught, so it won't even matter. So let's try this one. So this checks if WAF blocks dot and underscore. So we'll just go with that one and then go right here. Probably refresh it. Stop trying to break me. So WAF is blocking more than just that. So we go back right here. Bypassing the blocks and join makes the payload turn into the payload I made to, of payload also found on Twitter. So maybe it's blocking brackets and the join feature. Maybe that's why. So if we try this one and go right back to Google, let me just refresh this. We get ID was able to run. So it's basically you have to use the very last payload found right here where they obfuscated to the point where if WAF is blocking any of these. So I'm assuming that WAF was probably blocking either brackets or join if it was able to bypass this. So now if we go back right here, we could probably change up the payload and just put cat flag instead. So where it says ID, just put cat flag and then press ok and we get the flag so we just copy this and then set it aside here and that should solve the challenge and we did it so yeah that's about it for this challenge hope you guys learned something new today i know i did and i'll see you guys in the next one peace